still don't know what a teen was intending to do when he brought a knife and a loaded gun, a nine millimeter, to Clarksburg High School just a day after the shootings in Florida. 18 year old Alwyn Chen is locked up without bond, charged with possessing a handgun and carrying a gun on school grounds. Our Bruce Lachan has been looking into his background. It was a concerned student here who warned a teacher that Alwyn Chen might be armed. Security got him out of the classroom, took him into an office, and he admitted, they say, that he had a loaded 9 millimeter handgun in his book bag and a knife in his front shirt pocket. But we just do not know at this point if he was armed because he was scared, if he was showing off, or if he intended to hurt someone. The woman who came to the door at Chen's modest townhome in Germantown declined to open it. We cannot talk. Sorry? Cannot. Cannot talk. Can't talk? Can you tell, uh, tell me how he's doing or what, what he was up to? Not home, can't talk, she said, and then nothing. What appears to be the 18-year-old's Facebook page has just a photo of him, a quote from the late actor Peter Ustinov, and a picture he posted last year saying, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. Clarksburg's principal says he is just as mystified as anyone. I don't know about his motives. Um, I, I, you know, he, he, he was a good student. He's a good student. Um, did the, what we asked of students to do, um, participate in athletics and clubs and come to classes, and those are the things that he did. Clarksburg has stepped up security. The flags here are flying at half staff for the murdered children in Florida. Like the high school in Parkland, there are no magnetometers at the entrances to Clarksburg, and the doors are unlocked at the beginning and end of the school day. Oh my gosh, like he was here all day. Um, they didn't find him with the weapon until like almost two o'clock at the end of the day. So was it he gonna do something at the end of the day? Who knows? We might have found out more if Chen had gone before a judge today, but his hearing was postponed until Tuesday. At Clarksburg High School, Bruce Lashan, WUSA 9. Now, the principal says this was a case where somebody saw something and then said something, and it worked.